I want to take a minute and explain the relationship that a female has with God that most males, males don't have. And when I take this, I'm trying to explain how you don't appreciate yourself. You got to see yourself at the higher level, your higher self. Any female that get pregnant, God is taking your body over for nine months. He's like the contractor that's coming to your womb every day and building that fetus inside your womb. You have a relationship that's amazing. You just gotta think about it. Put some thought into it. Think about it. That's you having a conversation with God and find out what the deeper meaning of it. And let me know, I would love to know. But um, just to value that, before I could ever bow down for God, I gotta find something greater than myself on earth. I truly believe every female on this earth is a deity. She's a goddess. She comes from God's rib. Okay, she bleeds the blood of God. She carries God's child. She lives through the birth of a child. Far greater than anything a male can do. Far greater than anything a male can do. Your stages of your life, girl, woman, to manifest into that lady, only to return to heaven in a lady form, not a woman form but a lady form. That to me is powerful. Males, <laughs> we're angels. We receive the blood of God. Females bleed the blood of God. That gives you the ability to carry God's child. That is the beautiful thing. Truly find out as a blessing. Society has you looking at it as a hideous and grotesque thing. And we don't take the true value of the meaning of that. We can go to church and drink the blood of Christ, but yet we have a creature standing right beside of us and we can't appreciate her for who she is. That's crazy. But um, understand the deeper meaning. You're a goddess. It's not about a queen having royalty blood. It's not about a boo. It's not about a woman. Okay? God whispers to the spirit of a goddess. God whispered to the spirit of an angel. That's your celestial being form. That's who you are. That's the only thing that God can know. He'll never know your earthbound titles. He'll never see that. It's just your physical form. I don't believe God will ever know your soul. It carries sense of the flesh. But he won't know the spirit.